Hey guys, Mitch here. Today I'll be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 6 Beta 2. Now this is for the iPhone 4, 3GS, and the iPod Touch 4th Gen. So make sure that your device is up to date on iOS 6 and that you have updated to the Beta 2 over the air. Next, go ahead and take your USB plug and plug it into your device and the other end into your computer. Then we'll have to be putting our device into DFU mode for Red Snow to recognize it. To do this, hold the top and the bottom button for exactly 10 seconds. And then once that 10 seconds has come up, you can go ahead and let go of the power button, making sure that the home button is still held down for an additional 5 to 8 seconds. On our computer here, open up Red Snow 0.9.13 Dev 1 making sure that it is in DFE mode, and then go to Extras and select your IPSW here. This will be your 6.0 uh, firmware here. You can go ahead and select it, and then it will be identified, and it has been successfully identified. So then you can go back and easily just go ahead and click the Jailbreak button. It will prepare the jailbreak, and it will be patching a kernel. Then you'll be prompted to a dialog box here allowing you to install SSH. Now Cydia will not be installed on iOS 6 beta yet, but I will have a video down below showing you how to actually install Cydia on your iOS 6 jailbroken device. Now I'll be uploading some stages here and waiting for a reboot. Once the RAM disk has been uploaded, you should see some lines of code on your device here. And then after the lines of code has gone by you should see a pineapple logo here on your device this process has been sped up a little bit just for the video purpose but once it has been completed it will show that red snow is done here then our device we want to go ahead and slide to unlock it and then we'll be have to put our device back into DFU mode to perform a just boot uh, tether jailbreak here. So to do this easily you can go ahead and hold down the top and the bottom for 10 seconds and making sure that your device is still on and then once that 10 seconds has come up you can let go of the power keeping the home button down for an additional 5 to 8 seconds and then your computer should, rec should recognize your device in DFU mode. On your computer again open up a red snow then go to extras make sh making sure that you do select your IPSW again and then you want to go the just boot method here. Now this will exploit with Lime Rain again. And then it will be uploading the first, second, and third stages here. And you should see a pineapple logo appear on your iPhone here or your iPod Touch. And once a few minutes has gone by, the process should be done with Red Snow and the device should be jailbroken on iOS 6 Beta 2. So if you guys do like these videos, don't forget to give a like up, leave any comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. Thanks, guys.